from Sanford Stadium in Athens, Georgia. About to kick off, Lee Johnson will put it underway for the Cougars. Back deep to receive for the Dogs is number eight, Tony Flack, only a freshman. And number 17 back there for the Dogs is Daryl Jones. The kick to Flack, but way out of the end zone, and the Dogs will take over first and 10 to the tailback, Herschel Walker. The pitch to Walker. Walker gets maybe four yards. It is second down and six yards to go. All right, that was Buck Ballou, who, of course, quarterbacked the dogs the last two years. Lastinger's pass is incomplete and turned it for Chuck Jones around the 35 yard line. 37 yard line. Broadway's punt, not particularly long. Steve Young led his team to a 27 0 victory over the University of Nevada, Las Vegas. First play, passing, Young. Incomplete intended for number 84, Kirk Pendleton. This is Young. First and 10, Brigham Young at the Georgia 48-yard line. Early first quarter. Young, the left-hander, complete at the 42. Second down, and let's call it five yards to go. Pass is complete for a first down to Neil Ballholm. BYU on the move. Young, looking over the middle, who won a flag on the play? Thing down. George had come in with a man-to-man -man defense on that play, trying to apply a look. Young, deep, oh. and it's knocked down by Tony Flack at the five-yard line. Jeff Sanchez. Yes, he did. Excellent play by Sanchez. And George has got the ball at the 34. And Lastinger's looking. Now keeps and it gets down to about the 28 yard line. Barry Young is the fullback. They give to Herschel Walker the tailback. And he's down to the 24 in Brigham Young territory. There you see the cast, a soft cast on the broken right thumb. And Georgia has picked up the first down. Barry Young is the fullback. Herschel Walker, the tailback. And they give to Walker. He's at the 20. Out of bounds at the 15. To Walker. Walker's close to the first down. I believe he has it. At and the handoff to Young, and he's got the touchdown. Extra point. The kick is up, and the kick is good. And with six minutes and one second left in the first quarter, Georgia has broken out on top of Brigham Young by the score of seven to nothing. Butler. Butler's kick is taken in the end zone and will be down by Tiamalu. And he's got to be happy that he's the one that scored the touchdown. Brigham Young, first and 10 at the 20. Young, the quarterback, swings it out to Tiamalu. And he's caught after a two-yard gain. And it's second down and eight yards to go. The fake. Young looking. A lot of time. He's got four or five speed. And he's got the first down and out of bounds at the 31-yard line. Young. Markers on the play as Young throws up the middle and it's intercepted. 
intercepted by Tim Bobo, number 32, but there is a marker on the play. Before the game, Tony Flack brings it up. First and 10, Georgia, Lastinger back to pass, looking, and it is intercepted at the 40. Brigham Young, big interception, and number 46, Olmo goes all the way in for the touchdown. Tom Olmo. Olmo goes 60 yards with the interception. He goes all the way in, 60 yards for the touchdown. The extra point is kicked up and good by Gunther. And we got a tie game. Georgia 7, Brigham Young 7. goes to Flack one yard deep into the end zone and he's out to the 15. Flack to the 23. Carney Norris in at tailback now for Georgia. A new tailback. They give to Williams on the touchdown and now Brigham Young came back and they've got the momentum now so we've had a little switch there. Now the pitch to Carney Norris and he's out to the 36 37 yard line. First down. They've got a pot full of them. As you see, John Lastinger. And he hands off to Norris again. And he's up close to the 40. Lastinger. And he gives to Norris. He's at the 40, up to the 45-yard line. Third down and about a yard and a half of the first. They send Williams in motion and pitch it to Norris. And Norris has the first down at the 49-yard line. First and 10, dogs at the 49. Norris, and he's stacked up after a yard, maybe two. Chuck Jones is the other one. They line Tron Jackson in the slot, and they give it to Jackson on the reverse, fumble, and he's knocked down for a big loss at the 39-yard line. All right, Lastinger. John Lastinger, looking now, he's gonna run the football, and he's gonna be caught. At his own 42-yard line, the 27. End over in. Peterson calling for the fair catch at the 21-yard line. Now, this is Young giving off to number 20, Tiamalu. Young, that's the end of the first quarter. Georgia 7, Brigham Young 7. Young is the quarterback for Brigham Young, and he has thrown the ball well. And he directs the attack he's going to throw again. Left-handed, of course. And he's got Tiamalu at the 40, up to the 45, the 47. A, a headline in their press guide that I read yesterday. It said simply, no blue chipper. First and 10, Brigham Young. Just on their side of the 50. Quick pass to Hudson, and it's incomplete. Broken up around the 47-yard line by Sanchez. It is second down and 10. Georgia still with the fifth defensive back in the game. They send a man in motion. Young with plenty of time, and he's going deep. And it's going to be intercepted by Terry Hogue at the eight. Hogue intercepts at the eight-yard line. There goes Herschel. Herschel. 37. He's at the 37. It's Brown in motion, and they give to Barry Young for maybe a yard. Third down and a yard. And they give to Walker. He's got the first down, and he's got to the 26. And of course, they're now picking some holes for Walker. Herschel. Down to the 24. And to give to Barry Young. And he goes down to the 15, down to the 14, the 13 yard line. First and 10 at the 13. 7-7 seven, seven tie. They pitch to Walker. And he's stacked up. Fumble. Fumble on the play. Brigham Young has recovered the football. Brigham Young has recovered the football just across the 40-yard line for Brigham Young. 7-7 seven, seven game, just over three minutes left in the first half. Young. 
Pass is completed to 50 and the 45 and the 40 to Gordon Hudson. First and 10 BYU at the Georgia 39 yard line. Oh, Jimmy Payne in quickly. The illegal procedure, Georgia. Young looking, still got plenty of time. Now he's going to be hit by Crow. Tim Crow, number 91. For Second and 17, and Brigham Young. And they give it off to the back, and he's down to about the 36-yard line. Georgia 7, Brigham Young 7. The Cougars at the Georgia 26 with a first and 10. Young swings it out to Tiamalu. He's at the 25, the 20. Knocked down at the 20 as they get into field goal range. And attempt one more play. They got a timeout left. Probably go somewhere in the end zone looking for a touchdown. You're looking at Steve Young. Young looks deep and it's incomplete. In the end zone, a 38-yard attempt by Gunther. Six seconds left on the board. The kick is up. And the kick is no good. Time runs out in the first half, and Gunther has just missed a 38-yard field goal attempt. The score at halftime in Athens, Georgia, Brigham Young, seven. And Georgia 7. 14 minutes, 54 seconds left in the third quarter of play. Brigham Young 7, Georgia 7. Steve Young back to pass, and it is complete. And out of bounds at the 44. Their versatility in the passing game is really unreal. Second down, and they give it to Tiamalu, and he's got the first down with plenty to spare. It's Georgia 13-7 to winners over Clemson on Monday night. First and ten. Young looking deep, and Ronnie Harris has position on his man, and long count by Young. The drop, incomplete, intended for Hudson. to be fresh today. Jimmy Harrell back deep to receive for Georgia. And Harrell takes it at the 13-yard line. Harrell back up to the 19. Georgia to have five interceptions and only seven points out of that does not look very good at this point. And they give it to Williams, and he stopped at the end of scrimmage. He's got Walker at the tailback. They give it to the fullback. Williams picks up Another couple of yards. They've got Chuck Jones, number one, down at the bottom of your screen. Lastinger looking to complete his first pass of the day, and it's incomplete. A little change on the spill. I think that's John Young, number 30, a defensive back to receive. Peterson looking for some room. Peterson in trouble at the 30 and knocked down. Some at this point. Young back to pass. Swings it out here. Tiamalo, and he's got running room, and he's out of bounds at the 40. First and 10 at the 38. Quick trap. That's Scott Pettis, the ball carrier. Second down, and Young back to pass. He's been rushed and hit by Hope. Let's see if they call it an incomplete or a fumble. They say an incomplete pass. Big play for Brigham Young. Young, roll out. Trying to keep it himself and out of bounds at the 32. Georgia crowd's up, hurts in the defense. Here we go, fourth and four. And it's 
complete to Hudson, and he's got the first down and brought down at about the 21-yard line. Nine passes for 127 yards. First and 10, Brigham Young at the Georgia 21. Young looking across the middle, deep, got a man open, touchdown. Scott Colley complete to number three, Scott Colley, and Brigham Young goes on top. Extra point. Kick is up, and the kick is good. Four minutes, 13 seconds left in the third quarter. 14 to seven, Brigham Young leading Georgia. And it'll go to Jones, and he'll let it go. His counterpart, Young, is 20 out of 39, 277 yards, a touchdown, and five interceptions. Now the pitch to walk. Herschel's going to get maybe a yard, maybe two. Well, that's what Coach Dooley said that he had seen in the game against University of Nevada, Las Vegas. Of course, they shut those people out. Here's the pitch to Walker. Going to be short of the first down. First down, Georgia. The penalty. Lastinger has gone all the way. Sprint out pass. John's going to keep across the 35 to the 36. Second and seven for Georgia. They trail by a touchdown late now in the third quarter. They give to Walker. Herschel Walker. Out of bounds right around the yard marker. And it's on his part. Unable to use it in this game. Lastinger <laughs> picks up the first down before he's hit and knocked back. First and 10 at the 44. Lastinger's pass is overthrown. Marker on the play. 6'4", 260 pounds that the official we're talking to. Second down and 10 at the 44. Walker in motion. They're going to send Herschel deep. Lastinger decides to carry the football. He's close to the first down. John Lastinger. Walker, first down. That's automatic, Bill. First and ten. Walker. Finally knocked out of bounds about the 43-yard line. Second down and eight. Lastinger looking, and it is complete at the 30. That's the first completion to a wide receiver of the day. They gave it to Scott Williams, and he crosses the 25. And the pitch to Tron Jackson. He's knocked down at the 25. Brigham Young leading Georgia 14 to 7 as the clock runs out in the third quarter. They were driving, and Herschel was stripped of the football. Kevin Walker, number 14, alertly falls on it. Steve Young swings it out here, complete at the 15-yard line, and he's got some room. Second down, seven yards to go. And he gives it off to his running back, Casey Tiamalu. Third down and three. Brigham Young winning this football game by a touchdown. Young. And it's incomplete, intended for Hudson and over his head. Pouring down again, heavy. Here's the punt by Meese. Harrell takes it at the 32-yard line. Jimmy Harrell at the 40. And down at the 40-yard line. Walker has carried for 80 yards, and he breaks through. Herschel Walker, close to the first down. First and 10, Georgia. The pitch to Walker. Walker, four yards. Georgia at the 23-yard line of Brigham Young. Seven yards to go. They give to Walker. Walker fights down close to the 16. With Walker the tailback now, they put Williams in motion and pitch it to Walker. Walker may be short. Maybe 10 inches, maybe less than that. Seven minutes and three seconds left 
in this football game. Fumble on the play. Let's see. Let's see. If Georgia recovered, it could be a first down. If Brigham Young recovered, then it's the Cougars' football. Number 63 says it's Georgia's football. Did he get enough? That's Jumbo Weaver. They give a fake, and Lastinger's got the football out of bounds at the seven. Bill Lewis, the uh, defensive coordinator, tried to call timeout before that play, but he didn't. And they give it to Walker, and he's got the first down inside the five. Again, Georgia working with two fullbacks in the game. Walker at tailback. John Lastinger to the one. Second down at the one. They give to Walker. That's a fly oh, touchdown. Slam dunk time. Herschel Walker in the end zone. Look at the Weaver. Good blocking. And Herschel goes up. And in the meantime, Kevin Butler has just kicked the extra point to tie the game. 14-14 with five minutes, 36 seconds left. Lastinger swings it out to Walker over his head. He probably read the defensive back. Second and 10. Georgia's at their own 33. Lastinger looking over the middle, and it is incomplete. Clarence K, third down, 10. Lastinger, pass is complete. First down. He had to drill it. Pitch out to Walker. Unbelievable. Incredible play. What strength. Unbelievable. But uh, he was just born with it. Natural talent. Walker picks up close to three yards as the clock ticks away. They give it to the fullback, Scott Williams. Lastinger brings them up. The pitch to Tron Jackson. Trying to turn the corner. He's going to be caught at the 26. 44. It'll be a 44-yard field goal. Jim Broadway holding a minute, 16 seconds left on the clock. The kick is up. It's there. And the kick is good. What a pressure kick, too. Oh, it's this is the guy you won't kick it in this situation. He's only a sophomore. Kevin Butler has just put Georgia on top of Brigham Young, 17 to 14, with a minute and 11 seconds left in the game. Number five, set to kick off, and he booms this one into the end zone and out. He has had a career. Tiamalu is number 20, another man to watch for out of the backfield. Young looking, pressured, throws and it is complete at the 40-yard line. That is complete to Scott Colley as the clock starts again. 56 seconds. Young looking. Looks over in the flat. It's almost intercepted by Holt. Terry Holt, number 14. The Bulldogs went into the game about a touchdown favorite, ranked sixth in the nation. Brigham Young, ranked 19th. Young, Parker on the play as Young looks deep. And Ronnie Harris may have intercepted the football. Penalty flag down. Penalty marker on the play as Ronnie Harris comes up with the football. It was procedure against BYU. Six interceptions for Georgia. At quarterback for Georgia with 43 seconds left. Remember, Brigham Young cannot stop the clock. And uh, Kevin Butler came through in a pressure situation where he had to get the job done and drilled it like a beautiful field goal and that was the difference there it is they stopped the clock the clock had stopped with two seconds left but the officials are headed out there you see Vince Dooley and Lavelle Edwards meeting at midfield Georgia has just beaten Brigham Young 17 to 14 we will be back with more from Sanford Stadium right after this.